So continuing on with my super deformed painted kits. Here we go. Um, I kind of changed the color scheme a little bit, especially for the shoulder. There's supposed to be a gray part around the red, or usually use gun metal, but I've changed that. Otherwise, it's supposed to be close um, to the box art. So, you know, like painting the feet yellow. I did put the stickers on here, and I'm not quite sure how's the this uh, the torso is painted in the front skirt because um, they usually have the armor on. So I'm just guessing. And for the most part, I just added the red and uh, gunmetal on the vents down there. On the back, not so much, just a little bit more pile lining. And there's a, like a kunai there, but I just added, painted it with the uh, platinum. Gunmetal on the rivets. And there you go. I added platinum on the this part here with the metallic green in the middle. And panel lined it. And uh, didn't do anything with this piece. Just stickers on the this one, the mask. And painted the red on the face mask. And another red on the chin. And there we go. So, what do we put on the armor? Uh, let's see, what's a good way to start? Um, oh, before I get there. Weapon. I kind of messed up on the yellow, but it's pretty much what the box art is. Yellow, a bit of, um, it's supposed to be white, but I use platinum for most of my white. And red. And here's the clippers, or pliers, or not much sure. But um, the handle is supposed to be yellow, but I just, you know, stick with, uh, or not put painting it because he's putting the hands and that might kind of scrape it off. So I'll leave it as is. And again, if you're painting um, light colors on black, or black or blue, you gotta put a white first, or like a base coat or prime it, then add the color you want it. Now for the armor, why don't we start with the head here. Add a gunmetal on the rivets there. I put yellow first again with a yellow, yellow. Wait, just said it. I put white first, then yellow. There we go. Not there on the back, but yeah. Might have to fix that part there. It's for some reason, that's the only part that's messing up. Shoulder armor. Goes here, comes up there. There we go. So again, I painted the yellow and red on this one. And um, why don't we start with the or add the swords? For the sword, platinum on the blade, yellow on the hilt, and red. On the tip of the handle and uh, pretty much this one just goes over here the other one same thing there you go goes in the back and um, let's see one of the important parts of this kit the front armor uh, for the most part, platinum on the tools, in this part here, and added red and yellow. Looks really nice. So, um, well, if you get this kit, you have to paint the, the front part to make it look nice. And now we're going to add this in the middle. There you go. And um, why don't we put the fit armor. Added the red. And the front part is supposed to be gray, but I usually use gunmetal. There you go. Put, uh, just put it here. Try to be careful not to scrape off the yellow on the feet originally. There we go. And next, um, oh, before I forget. 
put this on the back this one I added yellow and power line the black parts and got metal on the handle and it looks really nice oh another tip uh, if you're painting your kits and you find some jagged lines there on the side um, use a gunner marker and you know just outline it and it will help and I should have done that with the rest of the kit but <laughs> only done on certain parts there we go that's the backpack now what else we need um actually I'm forgetting a piece but eh, we'll leave it alone that's on the back of the head but you already seen another my other review of this one or my preliminary review so this is the shoulder armor really nice so I've used platinum on the pipes and yellow over there and uh, platinum inside there but the this um, spring or coil I've used gunmetal and it looks pretty good both sides and here's the other one and there we go a really nice kit and um, I really recommend this kit <laughs> he has so many stuff on him but it does require a lot of painting again this is Meats thank you for watching